Hello and welcome to your first instrumental music distance learning assignment. It's Mr. Hermes here. I hope you're all doing well and keeping healthy, staying safe. For this assignment, we're going to give you a couple weeks to complete this. Uh, the goal is to record yourself, um, audio, video, or both, and uh, using the following practice strategies that we are going to be going over today. Uh, in the assignment, you have different pieces of music that you're going to be performing. Uh, if you are in beginning band, that's section 48, we're going to be using fast track band. If you are in beginning orchestra, section 49, we're going to be using our string basics book. And if you are in any of the intermediate or advanced sections, we're going to be using the uh, solo and ensemble repertoire music. Now, today we're going to be going over the fast track band portion of those assignments. However, any of these practice strategies can be used for any of the sections on any of their assignments. Let's begin. Before you play, you need to make sure that your instrument is ready to go and cleaned. If you haven't cleaned your instrument recently, especially your mouthpiece for those brass and woodwind players, you want to make sure that you're cleaning that out. If you're not sure how to clean your instrument properly at home, please send me an email and I can go over some of the steps for you to make sure that your instrument is ready to go. You also want to make sure you're oiling any valves, uh, making sure slides work for trombones, making sure we have the right amount of reeds for woodwinds, and my string players making sure we are in tune, our bows are rosined and tightened or loosened to the right degree. So play your instrument a little bit first, make sure it's working, and also we want to go over a little warm-up, which we'll get to later on in this lesson. You also want to make sure you have all the materials that you will need for this lesson. Find the music that's appropriate for this assignment. If you cannot find it or you need it, please send me an email. Please make sure you're also using a metronome when you practice because playing in tempo, playing in rhythm is going to be part of the grade. And any other tools you might need to help you practice, such as a pencil or any other tools that you like to practice with. 